hello Libra and cross watchers and whoever else wants to watch um, this is your February reading for this current year yay all right so this is for the sign of Libra in Sun Moon rising and Venus right please check your charts if this resonates with you kill cool. if not you just boop your nose away it goes there's no point worried about shit today even about you or is none of your damn business right right now let's see oh yeah um if you want a personal the info is down in the description box underneath all of the music channel listings right you can go there if you want okay so anyway libra you have a new start in your beginning theme right but i feel like there's a lot of baggage from the past that like you're dealing with too it's like you gotta do mess with a bunch of shit before you can get to this and, I, and I'm not sure if you want to or not <laughs> like the cherry right here it's moving forward to move past what you once dealt with emotionally to much more happier and greater things however the situation calls for you like logging off or pulling or hauling um, a bunch of shit and it's like betrayal. It's like either you were betrayed or you betrayed somebody. But, it, but there's this like sense of like, you know, like there's a Benedict Arnold somewhere. Like someone just was a rat or something like that, right? Your wants and wishes is a tower to arrive because you're tired of carrying this burden. Probably something to do with the Seven of Swords since they're like crossing or whatever. However, your obstacles and challenges are King of Pentacles, and either, and he's got the Seven of Swords reverse, so either you're looking for an apology from him, could be Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or he's expecting an apology from you, one of the two, or maybe a reconciliation, or just even an admonishment of like something that went wrong here, but some of them might have been stolen from somebody, too. Um, up in the fears and rejections, it's your s sign. Also, as well, Aquarius and Gemini, Libra. But you have the Ace of Cups for first. It's like you're afraid no... Are you afraid nobody loves you? Or you don't want to give love or whatever? Especially when it comes to a new beginning here, since it's aimed at that. Technically, you have three of the four Aces up here. You have the Ace of Cups, the Ace of Wands, and the Ace of Pentacles. Now, the Ace of Wands is in the beginning theme, so I can't flip that one. But I can flip these two. So it's like... If I flip this Ace of Cups and this King of Swords, the King of Swords would be all pissed off and shit because he's got feelings. And this Ace of Pentacles down here with the King of Wands, the start of this shit and how it'll end, it's like he had an offer, but it was a shit offer. It was like rotted and disgusting and unrooted and it didn't do much of anything for anybody. That's what would happen if I flipped them. Because I'm not sure which one's the true one. And then we got this one over here. So this is technically the true... Like, I, I just don't believe you can have more than one beginning. It, it, like, no, you gotta go in fucking order. You can start something, and then as you're going along the way, you can get something else. But you can't start multiple shit at one time. How are you gonna focus on that, you know? So it's like these two can be flipped for any reason. So we'll see which one's more truer in that sense. Now, Libra... With this energy, right? Also in Crotch Watchers, right? Crotch Watchers. Cross Watchers, my apologies, but if you want to watch crotches, that's up to you too. No judgment here. We're all equal opportunity weirdos and such, right? Fist bump. Anyway, um, someone's ignoring their intuition as they're trying to move forward because they have no idea what the fuck to look at, what, the, what, what they should be researching, what they should trust. It's like someone feels like they're blind to knowing stuff, but that's because they're not listening to their inner voice. Or and either that or they're pretty paranoid about the voice, Leaper and Cross Watcher. Like they don't trust it. It's like, oh no, you son of a bitch. You you told me shit before. I don't know if I want to listen to you, you know? Seven of Swords with the Ten of Swords. Someone feels like they're dragging around um, the essence of betrayal. Like, it almost like guilt, you know? An old relationship might have been separated because of it. Or either that or a corporation, a partnership of sorts. Some emotional sentiment right here. That's being a secret. 
could have dealt with a mistress somewhere, but there was definitely a secret involved with that. Or someone's keeping their mouth shut about it. One of the two. Wants and wishes, Libras and Cross Watchers, is the tower because this burden is way, 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 way too much. It's getting harder and harder to carry. But someone's been pretending to be asleep while everything's burning. Like, oh, I didn't know. I thought everything was fine. I thought someone was having a barbecue. And it's like, Bill, half of the countryside's on fire. Half of our countrymen are dead. How, how do you think human flesh... Well, I thought it was just burgers, you know. But that's because they're being all in the dark with their feelings and having a lot of bitterness. Libra and Crosswatcher, whoever this is, it's either you or someone you're dealing with. But someone, I feel like... It's not irritation as al almost as much as it is anger, but it's not exactly anger either. Like, especially this fire, I don't know why, but it's like someone's... Oh, what's a good word for it, y'all? Animosity. Well, that's a hell of a word, but yeah, I guess that works. Animosity. They got animosity. I said that before once, a long time ago. But yeah, it, it's like they let everything burn down, acting like, you know, they were asleep or whatever, over animosity with the King of Cups reverse. Like, you know, he's kind of a heartless dick anyway, but not in this, but usually not in the sense to where, like, he's causing harm to people. He just doesn't give a shit how they feel by the end of the day. It's just like, my feelings are more important than yours. Fuck you. You know? Um, especially considering he's a water sign, and that's, like, it's water signs. But, animosity. Different kind of word. Okay. King of Pentacles and the Seven of Swords reverse in the obstacle and challenge. Now, th now, the Seven of Swords is over here with, like, betrayal. But it's over here reversed with him. So it's like, is he the one who was betrayed? Did he betray you? Is he trying to come back with an apology, possibly, Libras and Cross Watchers? No. Probably manifesting fate or making something happen. Maybe you think he's going to make it happen or something? King of Wands reverse. So maybe this Ace of Pentacles is the one that's definitely wrong in this situation when it came to the beginning. And maybe Libra and Crosswatcher are quite upset more than you are miffed about, like, this love that you have or whatever. It's like you don't feel like there's love right there. You're kind of afraid of that. But what's weird is, like, it's almost like it's saying foretold with, like, the magician right there with the Wheel of Fortune, right? Um, heartbreak. Um, shitty words or whatever it is. And what works between people. Hmm. Or maybe somebody, like, sealed their own fate with this, like, king of... Wands reverse. I don't know yet because I haven't gotten over here, so we gotta find that out. Alright, fears and rejections with your card as well as Aquarius and Gemini, Libra, and Cross Watchers. Uh, not having the Ace of Cups, not looking for it really anyway, but like not for any logical reason. It's like the Page of Pentacles, or not Page of Pentacles, Page of Swords is just like hovering somewhere else, going elsewhere, but. It's like they don't have a fucking reason. Or they're not looking for a genuine reason not to, like, have any love in this situation. Oh, poor investment. Poor investment in the house, and that's the Ace of Pentacles down below, too. What's up with this King of Wands, then? What'd he say? I don't think he likes you. <laughs> I don't think he likes you at all. Oof. We're gonna reverse all that in a minute. Mmm. Damn. Yeah, it's like... I 
either you got pissed leaving and cross watcher or like he sees you as like you know like either you got pissed because he didn't fulfill this ideal that you had or he's pissed at you and thinks that you can't fulfill the ideal that he has or he thinks that you miffed the idea or some shit right what's the ending theme in all of this please Someone was all upset with their emotions and took their fucking turtle too. Like I know I gave the, Steve Greg to you, but like you know I'm taking him back. Fuck that aquarium. Like I don't like you anyway. He deserves better. He's taking whatever. Um, but it it kind of made the burden take way longer than what it should. And someone doesn't want to feel like a fool anymore when it comes to how they really feel. Um, possibly about someone they really don't. <laughs> This King of Pentacles is reversed. It's like someone they really don't give a shit about. That's funny. Uh, like they don't think they don't think much of him. At least that's what they tell themselves. Only we're in Crosswatcher. I'm not sure. Anyway, let's go ahead and clarify, and then we're dead. So we got the energy. Someone is using your intuition, and they're probably cutting that shit down on a regular, just being like, I am not listening to the voices in my head today. No, thank you. Um, not willing to take that leap of faith, or if you did, like, you might have miffed it just a little bit. Um, all because you want to, like, ladies, bur once again, the ten of wands. Wanting to lay the burden down once and for all. But it's like, can you? Mmm. Clearance? How interesting. Alright, Libra and Cross Watchers. The situation with this clearance, right? Where, like... There is a breakup of something old, either a corporation, a partnership, a love relationship, all because of some secrets that were there. You know, ones that were not communicated, and that led to some bad shit. Or something. Like sprouted some nasty seeds. Left somebody uh, falling off their horse all drunk, getting drugged through town, too. Could have been with a water sign. Libra Gemini. No. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. That's why I wanted to say air signs all over again. My bad. Uh, wants and wishes, you know. Someone just left something on fire because of animosity. Uh, with the king of pentacles. But he's reversed right here. And it's like... He gave some shit. In order to sabotage? What? Okay, so he's down here with the whole, like, Seven of Swords, right? And Seven of Swords talks about, you know, like, probably getting caught up in your own bullshit or whatever, but it also talks strongly about apologies. And over here is, like, the Seven of Swords upright. And that often talks about, you know, like, sneaky natures, carrying burdens, trying to get away with something, right? Someone's trying to get away with something here, and someone either gets caught or is coming back to apologize here. But why is he rever Like, didn't you guys have this in, like, the readings I did for you before? Or some shit? If I remember right? Yeah. He kept showing up or whatever, along with the Queen of Pentacles. Right up here, what you want is him to, like, what, offer some bullshit? I mean, he might offer some bullshit. I mean, like, I'm not sure what his perspective is. I'm not sure what any of these people's perspectives is. There's a lot of fucking people. Um, no excuses for it. Oh, is, okay, Le Libra and Crosswatcher, are you hoping that I, this guy, this King of Pentacles, will just give you some bullshit so you have a reason to cut it off? Like to kill the birdie? One more. Seems like, I, I don't think that's gonna happen. I don't think this person, like, if you're, if you're expecting... I'm not sure if you're expecting this person to act out a certain way, or if they're expecting you to act out a certain way, but it doesn't seem like that's going to happen. Or if you're expecting them to have a certain persona to them, where it seems like they're not reliable or worth giving anything to, in order for you or them to halt whatever it is that's going on, it doesn't seem like that's coming up the way they want it to, or even the way you want it to, depending on who it is in the situation, right? Obstacles and challenges. The magician see like either foretold the fate of this King of Wands reverse right here, or helped to manifest this dude to be the King of 
wands reverse, right? Someone stole some cookie out the cookie jar, fresh out of the fucking oven and cool. Like just taking it, not even realizing it's worth, you know, which was a crossroads in this situation. Like, did you repel somebody? Hold on, one more. No, to get somebody to be like, ah, I didn't want your ass anyway, and then having them all feeling bad about it. Huh. Like, someone played mind games way too hard, but are still playing those mind games because they don't want to deal with this shit. But it's almost like they're trying to wait for this king of pentacles up here to fuck up. But it's like it's... No, it's at a standstill. It's not happening. Let's see. King of Swords over here in the Fears Rejections. Not really looking for information for why it would be good to invest in home or looking for excuses elsewhere for why you can't invest in home almost. Yeah. Someone needs to get off of that like fucking trip and realize they picked up a snake and somehow they got a dog. And it's just like, what the fuck have I been doing this entire time? Actually, look at this ace of wands over here mm, realize they might have been a douchebag expecting people to be their pets and shit we also have the king of swords down here as well mm. didn't i ask you guys before if you were dealing with a narcissist or something like that's what it kind of feels like it's like someone didn't bow down or someone's now realizing they were expecting people to bow down, but it's also like, ah, eh, they're not figuring shit out either or moving on from that uh, mindset where they think, I don't know, I guess, like, like I, I would figure, oh, I can keep this up forever or some shit. Which is like, you could. I mean, you could be that kind of greedy bitch. I mean, no one's gonna stop you, right? But it's like, ah, eh, I don't know, man. How this shit starts, how it'll end. The King of Swords. And since the Emperor's out here too, both of them are reversed, so it's double Dutch douchebag day. You know? Someone might be looking at you like you came off as that, or you're angry because that person is that way, and kind of ruin like some dream or ideal you had, right? So now, moving off, he might be giving you this King of wands you might be writing up gently could also be this earth sign as well you know trying to drop the swords in order to heal broken hearts fulfill wishes on a platter for you so you can get nice and fat off some turkey of dreams and shit and everybody have a good fucking time that's what he's trying up trying to offer possibly and he fucks up with the tricks ooh what else happens after that someone like isn't able to perform the tricks anymore and it's got someone looking at him like what are you doing mm. that is very interesting Libra and cross watchers that is also at the end of this reading hiya cool beans anyway so if hiya so if you enjoyed this reading please like share and subscribe you ain't got to if you don't want to, but I'd greatly appreciate it, of course. It's always good seeing you all. I love your faces, and I will see you later. Take it easy, and, you know, whatever. Bye-bye.